Welcome back. It is an exciting morning in Boston. Today marks the 126th running of the Boston Marathon. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Amanda Callahan now joins us live from the starting line in Hopkinton with more on the big day. Good morning, Amanda. Good morning, Caitlin. Nicole, you can really feel the excitement here in Hopkinton in the kind of chilly air. It's only in the 30s here, but it's pretty good weather for those runners out there. We're going to have more than 30,000 athletes from across the world lining up here at the starting line at Hopkinton and finishing up on Boyle Street in downtown Boston. Now it's even more exciting because this is the first time that the race is returning to Patriots Day in three years after it was canceled entirely in 2020 due to the pandemic and then postponed to last October in 2021. And people are more than excited about that. Now over 30 30,000 runners are coming from 122 different countries and all 50 U.S. states. They'll make their way through the 26.2 mile course starting right here in Hoppington and finishing over in downtown Boston. Now the Boston Marathon is the world's oldest annual marathon drawing in crowds of people from all over as well. This year marks its 126th running. The professional men's race begins at about 930 shortly followed by the professional women and at 10 a.m. the waves of other racers are going to kick off. We had the military marchers start at about 6 a.m. We'll have the wheelchairs men race at 902 and then the women's at 905. So we have a lot of excitement to look forward to here throughout the whole day. Live in Hopkinton, Amanda Callahan, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.